want to I want to guess. You're going to finish this song, you're going to do nightclub gigs no, and the no, show. No, no, You'll no, do both. No, it's a great no, idea. No, it's a great idea, but no. No, what I'm going to do and what I've got is an audition to do a TV movie, perhaps. And if I do, then I'm on my way to becoming a serious actor. Good darling of serious acting. Let me tell you a story. Years ago, we went down to a place called Brighton, by the sea. And we were staying there, and one night my uncle said to me, he said, Charlie, I've got tickets for a, an end of pier show. And we went there, and it was very good, we were right in the front row, stalls. I was just a shy kid. In fact, I was shy about being in the front of the stalls. And at one stage, a trampoline act came on. And during the act, the guy said, anybody here would like to get on stage and have a bounce on my trampoline, thinking that nobody would dare to because they'd be frightened, making a fool of themselves. And my uncle said, Charlie, come on, have a go. Well, I was shy, but... Well, he pushed me up there. I got on that stage, and I started bouncing about on that trampoline. And I was bouncing, and I was, I guess I was being funny because the audience began to laugh and began to smile and clap. I was really enjoying it. I was getting into it, except that I looked at the side of the stage, and there at the side was the star of the show, standing there saying, get this bugger off my stage. And I thought, wait a minute, it's my stage now. Oh. It's my stage, and I can stay on here as long as I like. <laughs> and you've been a ham ever since, right? Oh, serious acting. Happy. Which is back to bloody square one. But what does that have to do with serious acting? Can somebody pass me the weed, Jeremy, please? Sure, the actor prepares. What? Uh, Steve, this uh, script might interest you. It's called Incident at Three Mile Island. Oh, yeah? Pro-nuke? Pro-nuke. Nuclear. Um, no, I think it's one of those scripts that uh, tries to take both sides. Mm, far out. See, the main character, Steve, uh, works in a plant. And he's pro-nuke he's pro and his wife is anti-nuke. An American tragedy. I don't think you're taking me very seriously. Oh, Charlie, it's a little silly. You're so bloody flippant. I'm sorry. Mom, well, can you pass me the weed germ? My wife doesn't understand me. I'm so unhappy. I think I'll quit my job. I just haven't any more confidence in nuclear power. What do you mean? Sweetheart, what do you mean? Look at this. Sweet. See? Shh. Okay, keep it up. Kathy, I'm sorry I've been a bit of a bastard lately. It's just that if I don't get this audition, it's it's back to aren't people great. Quit the show? Mom? Quit the show. Quit the show? Are you kidding? We've, we've got expenses here. We've never had it so good. I've never seen you so depressed. I'm worried about you. Sweetheart, what do you mean? Sweetheart, what do you mean? Sweetheart, it needs something more humanistic, something more identifiable. Sweetheart, what do you mean? How would other actors do this? Oh, Albert Finney, for instance, he'd be North Country, wouldn't he? He'd say, uh, it's just like, like uh, sweetheart, uh, sweetheart, what do you mean? Oh, oh, Sir Eric, uh, Sir, Sir Eric, goodness, Sir Eric, goodness. Would you be born like sweetheart? Oh, no, no. 
that's quite good now. Let me think. Yeah. Well, there's Clark. There's a bit more class in there. John Gielgud. Oh, that's no good. Uh, John Herb. We could do John. Well, yeah, Peter Sellers. Or Peter O'Toole. Oh, no, I forget. Well, why don't I play me? Sweetheart, what do you mean? What do you mean? Sweetheart, 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 what do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, no. Just can't do it. Action. Sometimes I don't think I know you at all. Sweetheart, what do you mean? Oh, I don't know. You're working in that plant and all. You used to tell me it was safe. But, sweetheart, it's not sa It's safe. We just had a minor accident, that's all. No one was hurt. A minor accident, you call it? We almost lost the whole state of Pennsylvania. Honey! And with all that radiation everywhere, how do I know our little one won't become deformed or something? I'm leaving Harrisburg until this whole thing is over. Honey, don't, don't go. I need you now. Please don't leave me. Oh. Cut. Can we do it again? Well, we can't always be what we want to be. Yeah, I suppose now, Charlie. As for me, well, I guess I'm just about as happy as I can be. Well, you certainly look it. And don't forget that every cloud has a silver lining. I hate that and show. And at the end of every rainbow, there's a veritable crock of gold and all that rot. Duke, you're truly an inspirational man. Thank Let's hear it for Duke. I have a word from our sponsor. Did you ever finish that song? That song. That's Hollywood. Any credits on six? Bring up music tracks. Okay, music set. How's it going? The same as always. Okay, uh, ready one? Pick one. Well, folks, it's been fun. What's he doing? Hey, uh, do I talk you an answer? Charlie, where are you going? Peel Box APG, Hollywood, California, 90028. Well, I finished the song, and it goes like this. to go. It's Hollywood. Jack and Jill, Bruce and Bill, Manny and Mo. Go Hollywood. Down on the boulevard Saturday night. You've never seen such a colorful sight. But make sure that you roll up your windows real tight. In Hollywood, wackadoo, 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 where are the so many hustling stars? In Hollywood, whooping on game shows or parking your cars, poor buggers, that's Hollywood. 
Most every moment you'll hear sirens scream Follow that music and you'll soon reach the scene And you're bound to end up on a slab or a screen In Hollywood, last verse, don't go away In the tradition of countless marines Go Hollywood Tuck your equipment in super tight jeans Go Hollywood Saunter that boulevard, you're out for hire Milk all you can out of old men's desire Cause in just a few years you'll find that you are the buyer That's Hollywood <laughs>